right, here we go. TOL Season 10, the Franchise Era, Week 7. We have the Alkaline Energizers taking on the Chicago Robbers. Could be a uh, low-key exciting matchup, but we'll see. Energizers win uh, the kickoff, or the coin toss, I should say. They get the kickoff. Gould is gold with the boot. Magnum PI or Magnum TA, depending which way you swing. On the return, takes it to the 20 and no further. Craig Mack behind center, rolls out. He is sacked by Dick Butkus. Dick Butkus, one of his favorite acting roles for me was Hamburger, the movie. If you haven't seen it, good luck trying to find it, but it's a classic. Third and 17 now. Mack in the shotgun. Pitch to Magnum. Magnum, they're going to shut him down. Fourth and 12. Yeah, they have to punt. What choice do they have? Great for opening stand by the Robbers defense. Robbers off to a pretty good start this so far this season. The potential's there. Let's see if they can put all the pieces together and have a run at the playoffs this season. I'd love to see it. Of course, you know, even if they don't, they'll be poised for next season. The, the framework is there. If they can just apply the points correctly, they could be a contender. Only gain a one on that run. Jim McMahon in the shotgun. Steps up. Oh, well, he's got the speed. He'll get the first down. He had the wide open receiver there as he zooms past him. Got one guy to beat. 10, 5, diving miss. Touchdown. Robbers score. It's got to be ads. Yeah, Jim McMahon. Famous Bears QB. Probably the, the better two of the Bears QBs in this league. Justin Fields, of course, backup for the drunkards. Maybe they should start him. No. Uh, Bill Murray not doing so well as of late. They missed the extra point. Robbie Gould is gold. Banked it off the upright. Now up 6-0. Look at Magnum go. Mac shotgun. Pitches at the Magnum. Again, defense there. Although he gains three on that. Three and a half even. That was a long three. Something some of the owners in this league know about. A long three. Of course, you know, field goals, your kickers. You overpay them. You know what I mean. Pitch out to Mag uh, Magnum. Second and six. Okay. Keeping the drive alive little by little. Manageable uh, yardage. Flea flicker. He's got the wide receiver too. Power cell. Oh, way overthrows him. Couldn't get the dive. Couldn't get the jump. Missed opportunity would have been an easy touchdown. Magnum goes nowhere, fourth and eight, and now they're going to punt yet again. Stagnant Energizer's offense. They just uh, can't get the ball rolling with the momentum. Oxide punts. Willie Galt. Will he get a chance to return? He does. Takes it at the 13. Up to the 21. Wrapped up. Beware of the fumble. Hangs onto it. And the robbers take over. Man, play action. He's got a receiver open. Sees Marshall. Brandon Marshall. Ooh, defender was quick to get into coverage, though. Marshall had to stop his route. He couldn't keep it going and hit him in stride. Another play action. Again, into coverage. Receiver had to get to his mark. He had to dive. Pitch out to Forte. I don't know if he's going to get it. Nope. They're going to stop him. Fourth and seven in the Robbers' first punt of the game. Foot boots. Magnum. Pulling double duty, starting running back and returner. Takes it at the 20. Breaks the tackle. Pushes. Oh, but he fumbles. Robbers are going to recover. Big foot. The punter gets it. They're not going to get him. To the 10. To the 5. Touchdown, Robbers. Tough break for uh, the Energizers. You hate to see that on the punt coverage. You feel helpless when you see that guy there with no blocking and a wave of defenders comes at him. You just pray that he can hold on to the ball. But it happens. Nothing you can do about it. Extra point is good. Robbers are up 13-0. Looking to be in cruise control. This could end up being a route, but we'll see. Magnum takes it just inside the end zone. To the 15 and tackled. Mac shotgun. He's going to pitch it to Magnum. 
This play has not uh, been their best choice so far, but this time it works. He splits the defense. He's got some momentum, drags the guy past midfield, and they bring him down at the 46-yard line. Huge run up the middle by Magnum. Just went right through the inside linebackers. They couldn't converge. Now Mac, he's got select. Oh, had the wide receiver open. The defender knew what was coming, jumped up, timed it right, and batted it down. Mac, fake handoff. Defender in his face, throws it up. Incomplete. Two receivers, one defender. Nobody catches it. 19 seconds to go in the first quarter. Pro Cell Flea Flicker. Oh! I think that was Magnum. He was open. He just couldn't catch it, though. Now they're going to have to punt. A missed opportunity after that huge run by Magnum up the middle. Galt not going to get a chance at the return. Goes back for a touchback. Last play of the first quarter here. McMahon hands off. Forte immediately stopped for a loss of two. Excuse me, loss at three. Questionable spot by the refs. Forte again up the middle. Gains back one. It's still now third and 12. Let's see if McMahon can find his target. No, the pressure was on. It's super heavy duty. Gets the sack. I believe that's the Energizer's first sack of the game. And they force the punt. Neither team getting a whole lot of traction. Robbers had that first offensive drive, and then they, of course, benefited from the uh, fumble on the punt return. But other than that, offenses have been kind of trading punts. Defense is looking pretty, uh, pretty stout. Mac rolling out, looking. Everyone's covered. Throws it out of bounds. Wise choice. Just gets rid of it. Second down now. Another fake handoff. He's got a wide receiver open, throws it. Oh, chooses the wrong guy. Lobs it up to the covered, and you have the wide receiver one streaking down the sideline. A lot of tough breaks with RNG this season. I don't know if there's any direct correlation to the lowered, uh, lowered stats of these teams, but it's tough to see that happen to your team when you think you got an opportunity and just you know, QB throws it wildly, even though you paid him as much as he could with control and accuracy. A seven is still a seven, even if that's the highest you can go. Forte brought down for a loss of two. Man, another handoff to Forte, another loss of two, third and 14 now. Three and a half minutes to go in the first half. Play action, he's got a receiver open. He's got Marshall, hits him in stride on the money. Good for a first down. Robbers now in scoring position. McMahon, shotgun, delayed handoff to Forte. Forte not looking too fast, but despite that, gains four on the play. Are we going to see that same play again? Yes, no, we're not. He's going to pass. McMahon drops back. Everyone's covered. Gets rid of it to avoid the sack, but throws the interception to plus. Energizers take over. Robbers were knocking on the door. They at least probably could have came away with a field goal, but instead the turnover. Flea flicker now. Mac looking. Throws into coverage. It is completed. Caught by Magnum. Another shotgun play. Another pitch to Magnum. He's got blockers. Just short of the first down. Needs two more yards. Another timeout. Mac hands off to Magnum. Just enough for the first down. They move the chains. They keep it going. Minute and a half in the first half. They do not want to get blank. They want to put some points up. That is a step in the wrong direction, though, as Erlacher sacks Mac. Energizers out of timeouts now. Pitch out to Magnum. Gets up to the sideline. Can't break a tackle. Gains 11. Now third and seven. Fake handoff. He's got wide receiver two open to power cell. He sees him. Hits him in stride. One guy to beat. Gets a diving miss. Ten. Five. Touchdown. Energizers are on the board. The flea flicker. K power cell with the catch. Buster Mack with the pass. 
Everything coming together now. And they are down by six. Extra point is off the upright. 13 to seven robbers. Halftime looming. We could see an upset. Let's see how that second half goes though. Always got to factor in conditions. Condition changes. Man looking, he's got Marshall open. Sees him, hits him in stride. Excellent pass. Two guys coming, diving miss. Oh, they get him at the 15. Can they get the timeout? They do. Four seconds left, they're gonna bring out Gould for the field goal attempt. Robbie Gould, oh, he pushed it right. Off the upright, no good. It remains 13-7 as we go to halftime. Robbers leading. And we are back for the second half as Extreme is set to kick off and Galt, Willie Galt back for the return. Not much of a kick. Already up to the 30, tackled. And the Robbers take over on offense. Jim McMahon, QB sneak, he goes nowhere. Three guys there to stop him for a loss of one. Those QB sneaks are not really doing too many people favors this season. McMahon to Graham, wow. Two defenders dive, but they were unable to stop it and break up the pass. Good for a first down. McMahon pitches the Forte. Forte to the south sideline. Almost good for the first down. Nine and a half on that play. Another shotgun for McMahon. Here's the pitch to Forte. He's going to get the first down and a lot more. Forte takes off. Not a lot of acceleration. Couldn't really get a... A full head of steam on that run, but still good for a huge gain. Robbers in control. Forte again up the middle. Good for two. Shotgun, will he pass? No, pitch to Forte. They're going to ride uh, ride this drive on the back of Forte. Hopefully to uh, some points. Called play. Forte doesn't really go anywhere. Fourth and 11. They're going to bring out Gould again. Let's see if he shanks it. Mm, should be good. If he banks it, it should be in. It is off the upright. 16-7. Robbers add to their lead. Nine, up by nine now. Energizers have to answer back. They got to do something here. If they put the ball back into McMahon's hands, it might be lights out. They might be able to score, and that would probably be an insurmountable lead at this point. Look at Magnum go. I was talking about condition boosts earlier. I think he got one. Huge return. Energizer's already in robber's field position, or field territory. Excuse me. Look at that Magnum just breaking tackles. He's definitely feeling good. Let's see if they go with him again. Mac and the shotgun. Yep, here's the pitch to Magnum. Up the middle. Good for a gain of four. Why not? If it ain't broke, don't fix it. Magnum up the middle, breaking tackles, pushing his way. They measure it. Doesn't get the first, but damn close. Let's see if he can finish the job here. He does. He gets the first down up the middle. First and goal from the nine. Energizer's definitely wanting the touchdown, not want to settle for the field goal, although any points are good. Mac looking. He's going to scramble. He's going to take it himself. Touchdown, Energizers. Buster Mack, he had the receiver open in the corner, but decides to tuck and run. Makes the right decision, and it pays off. If they can make the extra point, the Energizers will be within two points. All they would need is a field goal to take the lead. But first, the defense has to get a stop. McMahon, Forte, getting the job done. Moving the ball effectively the second half. Not much of a return for Galt. Robbers are at their 20. McMahon, play action, he's got Marshall open, he gets rid of it. Jumping grab by Marshall, and he's gonna be off to the races here. No, he's not, those defenders quick to pull him down at the 41 yard line. Here's McMahon again, looking. 
trying to connect with Jeffrey. Throws in a double coverage interception by plus. Energizers are going to get the ball back. Terrible turn of events for the robbers as they throw the interception. Mac looking. He's got a guy open. He's got select. Catches it despite the defender there. Did not continue the route. He stopped at the 50-yard line, but it's still good for a first down. Man in motion. Mac faking the handoff. Defender on his tail. He catches him. Sacked by DeFridge. William Perry. Huge mountain of a man. Called play. They get Pro Cell in the backfield. Third and 26 now. Energizers. Looking like they're not going to be able to capitalize on the first down, but maybe I spoke too soon. Mac to select. Hits him. Good for the first down, but he fumbles. The robbers pick it up. Oh, it's almost like an arm punt at that point. He didn't mean to fumble it, but still. Robbers take over. QB sneak by McMahon. He is <laughs> met by the defense. He fumbles. Ultimate Lithium picks it up. He had the speed to take it, but he couldn't shake the last defender. Or offender. I don't know. Mac looking. He's got select. Sees him. Touchdown. Hits him in the back of the end zone. And the Energizers take the lead. Couple of sloppy turnover plays. Exchanging the ball. And the Energizers... Looking to be playing at uh, full power, pun fully intended. Benefiting from some condition changes. It's off the upright, it's good. 21-16, Energizers take their first lead of the game. 4.20 left in the fourth quarter. Here's Galt. Galt up to the 20. Makes his way to the 26. All right, McMahon has got to avoid the turnovers. Forte has got to hang on to the ball. Uh, McMahon with the QB sneak. Gains five, but got to be careful with that. That's what caused him to fumble the previous drive. Man under pressure. He steps up. He is sacked by Ultimate Lithium. Third and nine now for the Robbers. Another run up the middle. Defense had it dead to rights. Fourth and nine, they're going to go for it. If they turn the ball over, if there's a turnover on downs here, Robbers are going to be... Uh, Hard pressed to stop it, but they get the first down. They're going to measure to be sure, but they get it by half the ball. Robbers continue. 3.30 now in the game. Robbers need a touchdown. Big D with the sack. McMahon somewhat slow to get up. He looks wobbly. Slow on his drop back. Throws it into coverage. Graham catches it, though. Jimmy Graham? Could be. Third and ten. Man, he's got Marshall open. He steps up. He throws. Gets him in stride. They're not going to catch him. To the 20. To the 10. The five. Touchdown, Robbers. They take the lead back. And not a moment too soon. Well, maybe it was too soon. Now they're going to leave time on the clock. Energizer's going to have a chance. All they would need is a field goal to win. Gould banks the extra point. No good. A one-point lead for the Robbers now, 22-21. Wouldn't have really mattered. Energizers would still need at least a field goal to take the lead. Buster Mac dropping back. Sacked. He fumbles. Robbers pick it up. Brian Erlacher. Can he go all the way? No, they pull him back down at the four. Robbers with a lucky turnover, lucky recovery. Here's McMahon on the QB sneak. He's going to get the touchdown. Robbers increase their lead. Now 28-21. Energizers really need to block the extra point. Keep it a one-score game. They don't block it. But Gould misses it. He banks off left upright. Robbie Gould having not a great day. Missing uh, multiple field goals and extra points, although a big boot there, causing Magnum to take it out of the end zone. He gets up to the 12. Minute 54, long drive for the Energizers. Let's see if Buster Mac has a little Joe Montana in him. Mac stepping up, looking. Decides to run, but gets tackled at the line of scrimmage by Dick Butkus. Again, of Hamburger the Movie fame. Try and find it, it's... So good, it's or so bad, it's good. It's one of those movies. 
Mac is sacked by Richard Dent, cousin of uh, Harvey Dent, Two-Face. Third and 19 now. Mac, shotgun, taking it in his own end zone. Gives it the Magnum, avoids the safety, although they tackle him at the 5. Fourth and 18. They take their last time out. This is it. This is the game. Mac fakes the handoff, rolls out. Defender in his face. Oh, they get him at the 1. Mike Sigletary with the sack. Turnover and downs. Robbers have it at the 1. They just got to punch it in, whether it's McMahon or Forte. It's going to be Forte. He's going to get the touchdown, and there is your dagger. That's going to do it. Heartbreaking loss for the Energizers. They, they had victory right there. It was within their grasp, and then it was snatched out of their fingers. By turnovers and poor play calling. Extra points good. It's not 35-21. 45 seconds to go. It's going to be a futile effort, but Magnum takes it at the goal line. He's tackled at the 16. Mac back on the field trying to keep his head up. He hands off to Magnum. Magnum breaks a tackle. He's going to have a nice little breaks another tackle. He's going to have a nice run here. Too little, too late. But he takes it all the way to the 46 yard line. 15 seconds. Could be the last play of the game if they decide to run. They do not play action. He's got uh, select open. Connects. Stinger select. Two guys miss. I don't know if it's going to be enough. No, they bring him down at the two, just short of the goal line. And the Robbers win an exciting matchup over the Energizers. 35-21. Marshall, four catches for almost 200 yards. Impressive. Impressive all around. Both teams, good job. That'll do it for me. We'll talk to you guys later.